Now, first alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Tom Messner. I suddenly feel the need for a Q-tip and a lemonade. <laughs> <laughs> you got to clean your ear? Is that what yeah, that means? I'm like, I want to go clean my ears and drink some lemonade. That's pretty funny. Yeah, it looked like a great night for that. So uh, if you're heading to the ferry, you're going to be in great shape tonight. It is going to be hot there tomorrow, no doubt about it. Next couple of days are going to be pretty brutal. So hope you had a chance to enjoy today at least a little bit. It was very nice out there, and it's a nice evening. So you've got time still. This is Burlington, 1115 this morning. We'll throw it into motion. And you can see with the time lapse here, we did have some clouds around, you know, nothing major, but a few clouds here and there. And this is where we are right now. Temperatures, very doable, 83. And I think the real reason it's doable is because the dew point, while 66 is not ideal, it's still sticky. It's not as nasty as it's going to get around here. So here's what we're doing for temperatures. 77 Montpelier, St. J right now is at 80. And again, if you're heading to the fair, we're going to dip down into the 70s a little bit later on. It is going to be pretty darn mild out there tonight. You will begin to notice how sticky it is at night as the temperatures approach the dew points. So uh, I don't know about you, but my house, uh, yeah, I'm feeling it already. Next couple of days is going to be even worse. So storm tracker things are looking just fine out there right now. Our next weather maker is off to the west. We've got a warm front that's going to push in here, and that's why the temperatures will be on the rise during the day tomorrow, and the humidity levels will be going up as well. Maybe the odd shower or a thunderstorm during the afternoon tomorrow, but that's about it. Really all eyes on thermometers. We've got heat alerts for you. We've got a heat advisory in effect for our entire area. That's the orange area here, and you can check the legend, see what's happening outside of our region. What you need to know is it is going to feel like it's some 95 degrees to 105 degrees. Of course, we've been advertising this for days. That is for Friday and also into Saturday. Now, Sunday's no slouch. It's not going to be quite as nasty, but it's going to be fairly close. So what are we talking about and when here? All right, let's jump to Friday. Future heat index. This is the way it's going to feel to your skin. So in the morning, it's going to feel like we're in the 70s right in the Champlain Valley. Look at this by later in the day. It feels like it's better than 95 or so right in the Champlain Valley, closer to 100 in parts of the Connecticut River Valley. And then that night, certainly going to be sticky. Here comes your Saturday. We'll take you through the day. Once again, it's going to feel like it's well above 95 in a lot of places, pushing 100 down in southern Vermont, southern New Hampshire as well. So let's break down tomorrow. We're going to take the heat index right out of the forecast here, let you know that we are going to top out at about 90 degrees. Threw in that chance for a thunderstorm in there. Just tough to tell. A, if it's going to happen, B, where it's going to happen. Just know that that's a possibility, especially during the afternoon. Otherwise, it's simply going to be very hot out there. All right, future cast. Take it right to the overnight. Not expecting anything in the way of rain, really. I mean, maybe a couple of raindrops in the mountains. So here comes your Friday. It's a mix of sun and clouds. Yes, the chance for an afternoon shower, but again, it's not all that likely. It's all about the heat and the heat index is going to be pretty high, not only in the afternoon, but as we get into evening time and it's going to be sticky at night. Here comes your Saturday. We are going to do it again, again during the afternoon, maybe a shower or a thunderstorm in there. So first alert weather, partly cloudy tonight. Yeah, it's going to be sticky temperatures, mainly in the 60s and then for tomorrow, dangerously hot. No kidding. It's going to feel like it's anywhere from 95 to 100 and five degrees out there. These are straight temperatures, everybody. This is not the heat index. Five day forecast, 90 will do it to 94 degrees on Saturday. Both days we could find a couple of showers, even a thunderstorm here and there. Don't change any plans because the likelihood is not great, especially, you know, for one location. Showers, maybe a thunderstorm even on Sunday, just <laughs> a little bit cooler, 88. We clear on Monday. 81, it's going to feel good. 80 degrees Tuesday, Wednesday, some showers to the north, scattered showers Thursday. And then the two days after that, look dry. 